Those of the greatest age are at greatest risk. And yet, it is still somehow a shock to learn that even this centenarian is not immune. Captain Sir Tom Moore is being treated at his local hospital in Bedford. His daughter said he caught pneumonia, which is why he hasn't been vaccinated yet, and was being cared for at home before requiring additional help with breathing. He is not on an intensive care ward. The get well soon messages include this from the Prime Minister. My thoughts are very much with Captain Tom Moore and his family. You've inspired the whole nation, and I know we are all wishing you a full recovery. The joint England football team has tweeted, We're very sorry to hear this. We are thinking of you all. And from his chart-topping collaborator Michael Ball, love and prayers for Captain Tom Moore and his lovely family. Stay strong, sir. And fellow centenarian fundraiser Dabiral Islam Chowdhury said he looks forward to a Zoom catch-up. You are inspired me and the whole world as well. And as soon as you recover, I will have a Zoom with you. Many elderly people have suffered with COVID. Captain Tom is not special in that respect, but his fundraising last spring captured the hearts of the nation. In the middle of his walk, he told me that talk of being knighted was laughable. <laughs> well, really, the, I, I never ever thought of anything like that, but just imagine what Sir Thomas More would sound like. <laughs> but, but I think I, I looked on laughter as a joke. Yet, three months later, it is exactly what happened. The country had pretty much demanded it. The NHS charities he helped say everyone is rooting for him. Captain Sir Tom has made an incredible difference uh, to NHS charities and the NHS. It's not just the incredible £34 million that he himself has raised, but he has inspired so many other people to, to fundraise. Our thoughts, our prayers are with him, and uh, we really wish him a speedy and full recovery. Back in April, Captain Tom was the right man at the right time. Now, the NHS he did so much to help is doing its best for him. Simon Viger, Five News.